Hi, my name is Max and I'm a developer for IBM MQ. Today, we're going to be talking a little bit about IBM MQ. What is it? And why do we need it? MQ is the wiring between different parts of a business and between a business and other organizations too. What it lets you do is take data from wherever it's created to wherever it needs to go. So you might say, why do I need to do this? Why can't I just use REST, for example, to allow parts of my, my organization, parts of my applications to communicate? And that's a really good question because you can absolutely do that. It will work. You can allow two applications to talk using REST. But if you do, there are a few things you might need to consider. So first of all, you've got to think about this connection. If both of those applications aren't online and ready to do some work at the same time, then that's not going to work because the application that wants to send a message is going to be waiting uh, for this application to be ready to receive it. And so it won't be able to do any other work and that can be a real problem. Also, you've got to think about security and how you're going to secure this connection so it can't be eavesdropped upon. As well as that, you've got to think about disaster recovery and resilience. Like what do you do if something goes wrong when this message is being sent? How do you deal with a possible loss of that information? Finally, you're going to need to consider scalability. So if I look at the applications, maybe I've got two applications that need to talk to each other, but as I scale up, I may have more applications that need to talk and all communicate with each other. And when this happens, we might have some serious problems because now we've got to write and own all of this code, which isn't really helping us with our business. It's really just joining everything together. MQ is a form of asynchronous messaging. Now, what that means is that applications that want to communicate do not have to be online simultaneously. This is really useful because it means they process messages when they're ready to process them, meaning that the whole system is more resilient because these applications can run at different speeds. Sometimes, as part of a business operation, multiple actions need to happen. For example, if I go to the store and I pay for my groceries, I need to know that money is going to be debited from my account and it's going to be credited to the retailer's account. If something goes wrong at any part of that, I want this whole thing to stop and start again. That's called a transaction, and that's something that MQ is very good at. So in summary, MQ takes care of all of these things. And it lets you focus on adding business value to your applications. Thanks for listening.